Yeah, I bought a used um, T962 infrared IC heater off eBay, and let me tell you, this thing was a lemon. Um, so I, it powers on, and uh, if I press the uh, start going through the profiles and select one. The buttons are a little finicky. And then I go to auto execute. As you can see, the uh, the lamp light is on, but it's actually not heating. And you look into the drawer pull the drawer out but see those little asterisks are supposed to be the actual temperature and the set point is the uh, the waveform so the little asterisks aren't matching the waveform so no heating so I took the lamps out and I tested them bypassed all the circuitry and just hooked them up to the switch on the back and they turned on. They're a little worn, but they turned on. So I have a feeling it's the optocouplers. Um, the triax are probably working. I don't think they wear out, but those optocouplers, the LEDs are, they might dim. You can look in the back. Uh, manufacturing date might be 2003. August 2003 so it's an old unit and I'm thinking it's the optocouplers that are my issue here pull this out already done the Kapton tape mod got me one of these rolls off eBay and pretty cheap but uh, hopefully when I get this thing working it doesn't smell like with the masking style tape they used uh, but this guy doesn't look like it was really modified. Um, someone was using it. There's a little note there that someone printed out. So I know someone was using it. Maybe they haven't used it in a while. And the uh, opto isolators just wore out. LEDs are too dim to activate the triac. Um, see if I can. So that right there is the display board. Here's the microcontroller. Um, those little white ICs right there. That's the optocouplers, one for the fan, one for the heating element. And I think the fan turns on, but the, the heating element does not. Like I said, I bypassed it um, straight to AC power and both, um, I don't know if they're halogen tubes. Um, they're definitely not sealed anymore. They might have been from the factory, but they're infrared. Uh, tungsten wire most likely so after this Kapton mod uh, the only other thing I changed was I did the little uh, grinding away of paint where the ground is and eventually I want to these are sealed halogen uh, quartz infrared lights uh, heating elements and they turn on instantly whereas the, the ones in this T962 take a little bit to turn on so I'd like to upgrade with one more of these and and see what happens. But for now, I just want to get the the bone stock version working. And the first step is to uh, these are mock twenty uh, thirties maybe mock thirty twenty yeah. So I have to order a couple of those and hopefully that's the problem. I might test it. Uh, outside of the unit but lately uh, I've just been wanting to upgrade it so we'll see and yeah that's pretty much it Kapton tape mod grounding um, grounding fix and hopefully replace the opto isolator if that's the issue I don't think anything really wrong happens to the microcontroller uh, the display board looks fine. Fans run, so my money's on the, the optocoupler right there wearing out.